Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back. Culprit here, and welcome to, I think it's episode 8 of my Minecraft series. Oh, uh, yeah, there's my roommate. He is still in here. Like, every time I leave, I, I leave the doors wide open. He won't leave, so... Uh, he's not bad. He doesn't need a lot of food and stuff, so... And if I ever get locked in by monsters, I could always eat them. Uh, apologize first. Uh, I'm trying a new texture pack. It's John Smith, to those of you who don't know. It's pretty popular. A lot of people use it. Everybody tells me it's really good for kind of medieval-y type stuff, which is kind of the flavor. It's very similar to what I'm going for. So I figured I'd give it a shot. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, if you hate it, I'll take it off. I always mess around with texture packs, and then I wind up back to Vanilla MC. Because, just because I just have this romance with Minecraft. The simplicity and whatnot is great. I think it's graphically, it's just it's, it's incredible. Just like I said, the simplicity, yet it's just inviting and warm and the colors and all that stuff so uh, i'm just playing around uh, apparently like some of the uh the the textures or the images or you know skins in this pack are really conducive some you know weapon racks and things like that that i might want to use later on so we're just seeing if we can get used to it I, I already don't feel comfortable with all this stuff but uh today we're going to build uh i'm actually really excited about this, this is one of my favorite -er, favorite -er. Uh, things to do in Minecraft. I'm gonna just get started while I talk. Something I gotta get used to talking and, and operating. Uh, we're gonna start my mining system, my, my official mine, and uh, basically I'm gonna put it right there. You see that little face right there? It's basically begging to be used. Uh, uh, this is something that I love to do in Minecraft. So let's see, split this thing kind of in the middle. That looks good. Go five by five to start, cause you'll see. Now this is gonna be the first thing I have to check out. Now I don't even know all the textures, so if I start using a pick on um, gravel or something like that, I apologize. Let me just get that out of there. Actually, I shouldn't put that there. We'll just put one temporary down here. I want to kind of dress this up, make it look nice. I'll probably do the math a little later. I'm not gonna do it in the rain. I guess that's dirt. Yes, gravel. Okay. See, I gotta learn what the textures are. It's a little, a little tricky. Uh, I'm going 5 by 5 no, it's not 5 by 5 5 wide by 3 high. I think that's going to be pretty good. Cuz I do want to dress it up, make it look kind of nice. I want 3 It's interesting. I just I probably shouldn't have started with this texture pack as I am going on the ground cuz I don't know what to look for. Anyway, I want to put some posts and beams in here. To kind of just make it look a little nicer. So here's the first thing. I'm not sure. I brought some wood, but I think I'm leaning towards planks or you know boards. Of course, it doesn't look very good here. Right, so you know what we'll do? We'll do this one over here. We'll see which I like better. I, I might hold off on this now that I'm doing this texture pack. Yeah, I knew that was gonna happen. I just hoped it wouldn't. Actually, that's fine. That's kind of what I want to do. Yeah, well, in this instance, I like it with the raw wood. I thought I'd like the boards better in the uh, normal texture pack, but right now I like the wood better. I might even make it one bigger, but we'll see. I'm going to put some gravel in around here, but <laughs> I don't know the texture, so I'm going to leave that alone. Uh, yeah, we'll just put another guy right there, and that'll be good for now. And, yeah, that's pretty much all. I mean, I'm just going to dress it up like that a little bit. All we're doing is we're going slightly into this mountain. Not, not, not crazy. And that's all. We're going to just move in. Again, what is that right there? i got to look to see what ore comes out of that. I don't think it's... I mean, it's gold-colored. This is actually good, because I do need gravel. But it, I'm thinking right now I'm going to do all the roads in gravel. In the little city. At least at least to start out with. Because they wouldn't have... Oh, geez, they wouldn't have means to really do much else, honestly. Yeah, this whole texture pack is thrown up. I should have just kind of done this when I was messing around. But whatever. A little something different for you guys. So, like I said, we're just going to go on the mountain a little bit. Alright. what are, are those just discolorations? They don't actually mean anything? Or am I getting a certain kind of ore? Gravel. Coal there. Flint. I'm not getting any more coal. Alright, so it's nothing. That's just colorations. Um, why do I want three? Basically, I'm going to have uh, mine cart tracks here. You know, in. My red tracks out. And then one lane down the middle for egress, because I am eventually going to... Well, actually, I think, actually, I think I'm going to just make this level. There's no reason to pitch this down. It's just going to cause aggravation later when I do the minecart, so we'll keep it like that. So I, I think I have all the stock, or, you know, supplies I need, or at least, you know, supplies that I can build stuff. Thought I heard a creeper. Yeah, actually, let me make sure. Sounds, music's off. 
All right, because at one point I turned the music totally off because I did one video for you guys and the music was pretty dominating and I, and I apologize for that, which I don't really understand why that is. And unfortunately, I didn't. Man, my targeting is pretty far off. Again, new mouse. I'm still trying to learn it. Like I feel like I have sounds turned so far down. Now I just got to remember to check it in production. Make sure it's not so loud I, before I render it out, because I do have the ability to change all the audio tracks, which is nice. So, like I said, we're just going to cruise in here a little bit. Is that deep enough? Yeah, it's playing deep enough. We'll throw some more. Uh, why do I have all this? I don't need my axe for a little while. God, I feel so weird. I feel, oh, jeez. And I need my axe. <laughs> A little, a little something like that. I'm not going too crazy. This is kind of culprit being, you know, pretty, making things pretty. So basically, like I said, this is, I um, mean, it's so weird. I've been thinking about it kind of all day because I knew I was going to film this episode tonight. And I'm like, how, how do I make this entertaining? You know, like, what do I talk about and, and things like that. And, and, and for me, I enjoy this part. I, I enjoy seeing how other people operate. It, this is just how I am with everything. Like when I watch YouTube, you know, if, I, if there's a YouTuber and he sh he does like a uh, a setup video and all that, yeah, I mean, I'm always interested in what you know equipment and things they have, but I'm more interested in like their workflow, like how they do it and how they they've found to be the most efficient way to do something. Because I'm always looking to improve that, and it's the same thing for me with Minecraft. I like to see how people mine. I like to see how people farm. I like to see that kind of thing as much as I like to enjoy just seeing how people build because I like to see what they have worked out in their own ridiculous amount of time they probably spent in Minecraft what they think is the best system and then I steal from that and I make my system better I mean that's I think how a lot of people operate in a lot of different you know avenues of life so I mean obviously I'm gonna I don't think I have anything revolutionary uh, when I get down to the bottom I'll, I'll show you I do something a little bit different than most people but again it's nothing I might gonna be really so I want to change that for sure so we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We'll just match seven and that'll be it. One, two, three, four, five, six, and one more. Then we'll do more wood and then we'll make the little chamber and we will go down. Basically, uh, just the downshaft is going to be 3v3. Oh, did I bring ladders? I brought some ladders. Why did I not bring more ladders? Damn it. All right, so we will have to craft some ladders. That's right. I will make a workbench right in here. <sighs> did it again. So that looks all right. And this, who knows what it looks like in stock. We will check it. I'll check it out again. And I might redo the wood. Like I said, I was debating on it all day. But anyway, like I said, I, I talked all day or I thought all day as I was spending some family time with the wife and kids. And uh, yeah, I wasn't really there. You know, I was distracted thinking about Minecraft, which is pretty bad. Uh, how do you make you know grid mining and setting this up uh, entertaining? Because, you know, it doesn't seem like it would be right out of, right out of the bat. And... And basically, I, you know, it was more or less what was I going to talk about while I was doing it. And I'm, I'm a big weirdo, and I know some of you guys. I think it was a DT. I think if you're watching, you said that you, you enjoy mining too, probably more than any other part of the game. And, and it, I've been trying to figure out why I'm like that. There we go, some coal. That's obviously coal. Um, and I think for me it goes because, like I said, I've been playing Minecraft for a long, long time now. Uh, probably close to three years. I'm not exactly sure, but basically, I was one of. The, I was early. It was. It was early in. Alpha at the time, I believe it was. I think, like I said, if it tells you anything, you guys might be able to figure it out better than I do. I think I paid like six dollars for the game or, or something, and, and and that version was very different than the version we're playing here today. But it was still awesome. You could just tell the potential. But unfortunately, I didn't have the. P I wasn't the big PC gamer that I am now, and I didn't have the PC that I have now. I had a crappy. At that point, it was probably a Dell laptop. Not Adele, the singer, you know, Adele, laptop. <laughs> uh, actually, we're going to go s seven more here. One, two, three, five, six. Um, yeah, and it was terrible. It was a really bad laptop. <laughs> it was really bad. So I could barely, even then, I mean, obviously, I guess you can make an argument it wasn't as, as well optimized, but it could not run Minecraft. I would get, you know, barely any frames. It was, it was bad. And I think that's kind of where my love affair for being underground because if, if I take all of my time in Minecraft what did I say? One, two, three, right? Three, four. So 
that is the next one is wood. Um, I would say a vast majority of it. I mean, 60%, 70% even, has been spent below the surface. A lot of that has been spent levels 10 to 20, because that's where I like to hang. I'm always looking for diamonds. If you're going to do it, do it right. Go look. Oh, my gosh, I keep forgetting. I'm not used to that. I'm used to just using wood. And uh, I think that just comes from, you know, oh, man, are you kidding me? <laughs> All right, well, it's not going to be. What is that block doing? Now we're just going to go build the chamber and get going vertical. Um, but, yeah, like, I think my love affair for mining and stuff, it, it's very therapeutic for me. Uh, like I, I've said to you guys before, you know, obviously, I do a lot of first-person shooters. I play a lot of games where you're a high focus level. You know, you're always paying attention. You're always watching everything. Your senses are on high alert. And I, to, I, you know, I don't have to tell you guys. A lot of you guys play the same games. It's, it's, it's exhausting, literally exhausting. So, you know, obviously being able to just log in here, and just kind of veg out and you know you have to think about your setup and stuff like that and, and how to be most efficient but in general you just kind of go on autopilot and you just cruise and, and that's it and that's what i enjoy so you know obviously it, it does lend itself to that mining wise i mean but i think it also just comes from me from when i first played the game in that you know there wasn't as much danger you know i was able to just kind of get below the service I didn't have to worry about mobs at that point. Yeah, that's good. Man, I am tearing through iron. That's why I need to get this mine going. But yeah, it was as much mine. You know, I had to watch out for lava and things like that. And that, it was tricky back then because that was before. I said wood's gonna go there. Then I, right, wood's there. Shut it over one. So that's it. Um, that was before, like, if the water was above you or lava, it, it would drip through. We had nothing like that at the time, and and you would you would die all the time from lava or water and and things like that because you would drown and and yeah, it was crazy. Um, but yeah, I mean, if you played it right, you didn't have to worry, at least you didn't have to worry about mobs. And even if you did, I mean, you didn't really need a ton of equipment. You just needed some pickaxes and you go. And if you died, big deal. So I think I kind of, that's where I would be able to relax in the early play of the game. And so I, in essence, I guess, fell in love with mining in that sense. Well, I do have it on really bright and I don't notice it being very dark in here, which is kind of misleading. Yeah, look, I don't have any, I have lights here. I didn't put any... Now, I have the, the game settings on very bright because I just want you guys to be able to see, which is strange. Just get some, I'm going to do this one and we're going to start going down. So, yeah, I think, you know, basically my love affair started with the fact that I could just chill out and, 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 just, and just play the game and relax and enjoy myself. Cause, and, and it's just carried over. It's just continued and it's carried over. So, like I said, I'm going to bring them in. I might even make this a little deeper. Actually, you can hug the back wall. It doesn't matter. I can always make it bigger later if I have to. We'll do one more row and then we'll start heading down. But we'll just we'll we'll tip it more to the back of the the cavern. Yeah, you know what, guys? Actually, I think I'm going to log out real quick. Put the original skin in, and I will put this skin back on when I'm building because that's the only place I'm really gonna see the benefits. So hold on, hold tight, one second. All right, guys, we're back, and as you can see, good old-fashioned Minecraft. I just prefer it. And here you go. You see the logs here. I don't know if I prefer that or as we get in. Now, what I plan to do, I'm going to dress this up a little bit more and kind of make it more rustic because who the hell really mines a straight shot? What do I like? I like that. Like that, I think the colors are better to me, but I don't know. You guys tell me what do you like better. I know I'm overthinking something so minute. It's, it's kind of ridiculous. Um, I did run back. I grabbed some ladders. So now I have enough to get me down to where I need to go. As well as, what else did I grab? I don't even remember now. Just basically I made some ladders, a little extra wood and, and coal. I should have grabbed more coal, but actually now nah, I'm going to find plenty of coal once I'm down there. So middle tiles here. We're just going to dig this at the back. Because that's how I like to do it. And this way I can always make the make it bigger if I need to. She said... So, typically what I like to do, uh, I haven't seen, I mean, I, I haven't watched a ton of Minecraft videos. Too many guys do this. I usually do 3x3. Three three. I might do 5x5, five five, depending how ambitious I feel. I think on the server with 008 server, I do 5x5 five five just because, I don't know. <laughs> I just felt like doing something a little, little bigger than normal. Again, that's what she said. Uh, yeah, it's, I mean, I'm not Steve Carroll. Uh, basically, and I like to d dig down. I go down to level 10 at, at my feet level, which just tells me that, right? Yes. 
I didn't know if that was a Mahada or whatever. And I start, the, you know, the, the lower level is 10. So I do get a little below 10. I don't like to go too much lower. The lava gets to be too much. Um, and I still, you know, I find I, I do well. What I do is I put a water pool at the bottom of this shaft. This way I can just, you know, I'm very impatient. <laughs> and I hate ladders. They just take so long. Uh, that this way, if I if I put the water down there and I make it in, a, you know, just the way, I can just jump off and fall away. And I hit the water and I splash down and, and all is good. And uh, a quick entry. So now I'm hoping, I told you guys already, I'm hoping I don't see any caves. I, I just... You know, caves are fine when you want to adventure, but when you want to set up a mining operation, I do not want to hit caves of any sort. And, and you'll probably see me, you know, you guys might get frustrated. I don't know. You can feel free to let me know in the comments, that kind of thing. Um, I say that a lot. I've realized watching this, that kind of thing, that kind of thing, that kind of thing. I say it a lot. I don't know. What are you going to do? We all have these little phrases we lean on. I've, I've started to notice that, especially in this Minecraft series for some strange reason. Um, but anyway, I, I, if I do see caves, I will probably, for the most part, ignore it. I just, you know, I'm, I'm on a mission here. I do not want to get distracted. Now, <laughs> this is part of my OCD, which you all tell me is not OCD, but I'm just going to keep saying that because I'm used to it. Uh, a large part of me wants to take all this dirt out <laughs> and make it nice and pretty. But I'm going to leave that alone for the sake of brevity and getting, you know, something done. Yeah, normally I kind of don't dig this cautiously. I'll do two or three at a time. But this whole area at this point, in my experience, has been pockmarked. Oh, man, I need to add some lights. With a lot of uh, gravel and caves. So I'm just being a little more cautious than I probably normally would be. Actually, you know what? This, I'm at 60. I'm going down 50 layers. Basically, what I'm going to do is I'm going to time lapse here, or not even time lapse. I'm just going to cut ahead to when I get to the bottom. Of course, if I see anything of interest, I will bring you guys back in.